with roaming the middle of the field. A lot of transfers picked up in the portal. First and 10 at the 33. A bobbled snap. Does West Virginia have it? Yes, they do. And we have our... Aller was not expecting that snap. It goes right off of his right knee, and he was furious about something. I don't understand what he's upset about. He's still yelling at the officials about something that was going on. You can tell he was not ready for that snap. That's a huge mistake. Got to credit the crowd here. That Penn State here tries to flash here. Second of six. Penn State going quickly now. Aller goes through his reads. Underneath that ball thrown behind. With four receivers at the top. Here's the motion man, Singleton. Allen looks that way underneath. Wide open receiver, Clay Wallace. Okay, that was a wonderful play. Was this motion? Watch the motion. What is that motion going to do? It's going to open up this spot on the field, and now you've got an easy slant. Because, Gus, you've got to follow that motion all the way out to the creativity that we're, we're expecting more of. And now here, another motion. First down to Ted at midfield. Allers hits the seam, and he's got Wallace with a burst. Trey Wallace, touchdown, Penn State. 50 yards. Coach K dialing it up as he comes from Kansas to Happy Valley. More explosive plays and more specifically forcing the ball down the field. This is just a little play action in the backfield. And now Drew Aller has got his choice. He's got both wide receivers and he throws it right on time and right on target. You see that ball placement, Gus, right on the face mask. Up, you get him a free throw and now he's got the rhythm. That's exactly what just happened on that last sequence. Easy bucket, here's the option. And it's Pabula. Lost the ball. And West Virginia has it. Was he down is the question. Round. And as that ball came loose. I think that was a fumble there because he's on top of the defensive player. That's great hustle. See right here. He well, that shin. That's going to be close. But that the runner was down prior to the ball coming loose. The previous play is under further review. It's a big one here. They rule him down. They're so Coach K trying to make things smooth. Play clock winding down. Aller steps up, wants to run on the move, and a pick of the first down and more. First down, Penn State. He's looking over to his right right away, but when he doesn't see it, watch the decisive nature of how he runs right up the middle of the field to gain this first down. Aller again, dancing in the pocket. Throws off his back foot, and that went out of bounds and a lot of details to execute. Second down and long at the 30. Aller with time. Sideline throw. Oh, he just stepped into that one. Positivity to this offense. And that's what they feel like Drew Aller is going to really be the beneficiary of is that new rhythm. And boy, that was a great throw to Trey Wallace. And they said Trey Wallace was... Aller underneath. And it's caught by his tight end, Tyler Ward, first down, Nittany Lions. Love this. They, they love their tight end, and what they're going to do is get man-to-man, -man, and they just run a quick out route to him, and this is an easy, easy throw for Aller on a fourth down for a conversion. Aller again, underneath, drops it off. A wide open, Catron Allen, touchdown, Nittany Lions. I'll tell you what, the big Zamboni, he's drawing it up here in the second quarter. Penn State looking fluid on offense. Gus, what makes the smooth ice? Well, the defense blitzes from this right side, and that allows Allen to get over just where he vacates. And look, there's nobody left. The throw's just on the back hit, but now it's all about Allen sniffing that goal line and diving to my sleeper team this year. First to 10 of the 21. Here's Allen. Goes through his progressions. Underneath and complete. All right, big... Allen in the shotgun. Wallace in motion. Allen looks that way. Delivers to the sideline. Oh, danger. Throw. Aller throws to his back shoulder. Watch as Aller releases this ball. You can tell Trey Wallace, he is not ready. And look, he's kind of trying to fade back there. And they are lucky that that was not picked off and run. This last year. They started the game with 20 different formations in their first 20 plays. Here's Aller to throw it. Aller goes deep. Aller down the field. And it's caught. Inside the 20, Omari Evans. And they were talking about him in our meeting yesterday. That timing of the game, you feel like almost West Virginia 
was lulled to sleep. You see Burks right there. He gets himself turned, going the wrong direction. Aller actually underthrows this, and Amari Evans maybe gets away with a little bit of a push right there and gets himself free. Did he extend and push off? Oh, absolutely. That's a miss right there, and Omari Evans benefits, and now he gets the ball deep inside the 30. See that left arm right there? That's a shove, and he gets away with it on a big, deep ball. And this is the one. Two receivers make it three at the bottom. Aller looks the other way, floats it, back shoulder. What touch on that ball by Aller. Boy, we saw an amazing back shoulder catch from Travis Hunter on Thursday night. And this one also contorting his body. Trey Wallace going back with that foot, dragging both feet, dragging into the end zone. Gains control. He's got to maintain that through the process of going to the ground. And it looks like he does. And just like I told you, Penn State, with that clock time, take a shot to the end zone. They do it to their number one target and Trey Wallace pays it off. Three plays covering 81 yards. Folks, the Penn State no, offense scored in 20. Allen, he's had the hot hand lately. Pulls it down, looking for the first down. And the big fella will get it. Drew Aller, he's not a great runner, but he's served. A willing runner, Gus. It's not about how great you are making people miss as a quarterback like Aller. But right there, once it's open and there's green turf in front of you, you've got to get there and then have an understanding for where the line to gain is. Look at him peek right there. And now he, he sees it, and he's going to dive forward, protecting the picks from a year ago. And they got great push on that last first down. Aller, quick strike on the hitch to the far side. Ball caught by Singleton. And he'll go out of bounds inside. West Virginia Territory. And a flag here late. 47. Play fake. Allen sets. Sideline. Nice split. And Omari Evans. He is bottled up and taken down. Allen with time. Allen looking. Cuts it in. Nice move. And he'll slide down for first down. Close to the 30-yard line. Check him out as he runs to the right side. Watch this, Gus. As he takes off to the right, watch. He's just going to give like this little pump fake. And as a quarterback, something that every single coach will tell you right there, right, right here, he pumps out to the outside. They'll tell you that defenders are like trained seals. You pump the football, they're going to jump at the football. Second and nine at the 38. Allen in trouble. Allen buying time. Turns a corner on the move and just steps out of bounds at the line of scrimmage. Aller. And that one caught, but not enough for a first down by Tyler Warren as he bats it to himself. Here in 2016, when Penn State won the Big Ten title in a game over Wisconsin. Aller flings it out wide and incomplete. Let's look at so that they can go be better in the regular season. It's so that they can go attack and win those games. Aller slobs it up. And incomplete. Well knocked down. Well defended by. This flag came out and it looked like they were going to call for defensive pass interference. But we've seen a lot more contact than this get called. And Ohio, or excuse me, Penn State was the beneficiary of that. Garnett Hollis Jr., he's a guy that transfers in from Northwestern, so a Big Ten guy coming in here to the Big Twelve. Six. Whoa. Aller. Looking, steps up, in trouble. Reverses his field. Buys time. And gets out of bounds. A five-yard gain, Josiah Trotter giving chase. Talking about Trotter, first of all, is going to be involved in the rush. He's going to blitz straight up the field here, and now he's spying Drew Aller, and here he is. He's behind him, and there he's just going to get on his horse and go. Come on. Number 40, there he goes, and bam, makes the tackle before the line to gain. That is hustle right there. That's what you'd love to see, a guy just pursuing the football. Katron Allen back in the game and running back. Aller, you throw it. No, he wants the quarterback run. Nice stiff arm, stays on his feet, leans forward and picks up the first down. Rebula in at quarterback. Rebula will throw it. Caught. Touchdown. Wow, what a wrinkle, Tyler Warren. And the big Zamboni 
is really dialing it up now. Studying the previous year. So watch these linebackers right here for West Virginia. They know, based on film study, that when Perbula is in at quarterback, Penn State runs the ball 80% of the time last year. So what did Andy Kotelnicki do? He